hi there welcome my dear students so in this lecture I'm going to show you how to download and install the node.js in your laptop or in your computer so what you have to do you have to open up your browser and you have to type right here like node.js and hit enter so uh, node.js you can use node.js to create your APIs and uh, link that APIs to, with your mobile application or with your application or, or with your web application or with your desktop application. There are a lot of use of Node.js. So what I, I am going to do now, I have, I'm going to click right click here and open link in new tab. Click on it here. Here you can see a new page appears and uh, here can you see it's saying download for Windows x64 page so uh, if you are Mac users you can go for the Mac options so for the Windows user you here can you see that it's saying 18.14.0 LTS and it's saying recommended for most users and after that there is 19.60 19.6.0 current so and th this is the latest features with the latest feature so I recommend you to download the uh, this one recommended version because this is the stable one uh, this is not going to create any kind of conflicts with your software in your applications but uh, the current version the latest version sometimes I face problems with the latest one so always what I do for myself I always download the recommended version so just click on it and this is going to download the node.js in your laptop this will take few seconds it's taking 20 20 seconds and uh, it depends on your internet speed so let's wait for few seconds and uh, we will start installing the node.js into our laptop so meanwhile if you like my videos kindly subscribe like comment my video comment on my video and uh, if you have your fellows who are facing problems in installing softwares you can ask them to watch this video and there is one more thing I have an email address you can ping me on there one dots dev at gmail.com so this is my email address you can ping me on this email address if you find any issue any kind of problem if you have any kind of project related issues like node.js about react about any kind of problem you can ping me there okay so here my software is installed what I'm going to say open or you can show in folder and from the downloads you can double click on the software and you can install right now what I'm going to do I'm going to say from here open up my full open up my software you will see a pop-up like this one what you have to do you have to click on next after that what you have to do I accept the terms and license agreement you have to click on next I will suggest go with the default location or you can uh, by clicking on change button you can change the destination folder of the installation after that you have to go on next here if you open up okay leave that as it is and it's saying this feature requires 66 MB on your hard drive it has one of one sub feature selected blah 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 okay so basically you need 66 MB for the installation of this software so you have to click on next and it's saying automatically install necessary tools note this will also install chocolatey this script will pop up new window after the installation uh, if you need this you can install that for my purpose I need that I need some important tools that comes with the node.js I'm going to checkbox I'm going to mark this check this checkbox and after that what you have to do you have to click on next and just click on install this will take few minutes to install on your laptop let's wait for the installation to be complete yeah here you go can you see our installation has been complete you can click on finish and after that you will see a pop-up like this one <clears throat> a CMD command line so what you have to do it's saying press any key to continue hit enter okay I hit one time you have to hit again enter or any key can you see the text has been changed again you have to click enter you have to press enter sorry not click okay after that your pop-up is going to be changed 
the PowerShell is going to be open. This will take few minutes uh, like this is going to take depend on your internet connection this will take maybe 10 minutes maybe 20 maybe 30 minutes you must have a stable internet connection for this one so if you if they got any interruption this will take uh, maybe this uh, your installation is going to be disturbed and uh, I will suggest you must have a stable internet connection for installing the Node.js settings so this is it uh, this will take some time and uh, your node.js will be okay once your node.js is done what you have to do you have to type here you have to go here and you have to open the cmd and in here you have to type node hyphen v this one this one is the flag and we, uh, this one is the v flag and this one this one called hyphen someone called this dash I call this hyphen and after that the V flag so what this is going to show me this is going to show me the node version so if you see the node version that means your software ha installation has been done completely but don't check this right now let this progress this uh, one complete after that you can check the node version or well, let's run this command right now uh, one second no, it's not working. Yeah, it's working. Can you see it's saying that node hyphen v v18.4. Uh, so node is installed, but right now it's downloading the Python uh, and some other important packages in my laptop that are good for my development purpose. So it's working on that, and yeah, that's it. So you have to wait for this uh, setup to complete, and once this setup is complete, we are good to go. So see you guys next time. If you face any issue, you can ping me on my email and uh, I'll get in touch with you on Zoom session or we can do a Google Meet. And take care. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.